Welcome back to Myth Force. In today's video, we are going to be checking out Rico, the rogue. I'm very interested to see how he performs. The melee uh, class that we tried previously, the knight, Victoria the knight, was a lot of fun. So we'll see how Rico fares. Alrighty, we're going to start off by looking at Rico's abilities. His passive has a faster attack speed, so it just faster attack speed overall cool the first ability is pocket sand uh rico blinds groups of enemies by throwing a power <laughs> powerful a pocket full of sand in their eyes okay deadly thrust which is a lunge rico leaps forward to unleash his signature thrust attack on the nearest enemy hmm, okay and his ultimate ability, Backslash. Rico teleports behind the enemy and delivers a devastating slash, slashing attack. That's pretty standard for a rogue. Traditional style rogues want to be not the center of a fight, not the center of attention, be sneaking the shadows and get those backstab crits. At least I'm basing that off of classic Dungeons of Dragons, you know, D&D stuff. But that's just kind of the bread and butter of a rogue cool same as before telling us how to play so all right now we do have okay so we have both a sword and a dagger i don't really know how to use hmm okay we're just gonna have to try it maybe it's just a quick so this is blocking. It blocks, and if I right click, it stabs with it. And then if I don't, I just swing the sword. So maybe that's just a, a quick, easy way to counterattack. That'd be very roguish. All right, let's hop in. Looks like it has a higher crit. Hmm. Yeah. If I block... No. It's just kind of a... Quick, easy... Yeah, it's just fast. It seems to be just fast. You can block with it, so it's kind of got some... Vers versatility. Alright, cool. So that's how the dagger works. I... It's gonna take some getting used to. But I think I like it. Can you power you can't power attack with it, so I guess that's one downside. Huh, okay. Let's try pocket sand. Let me see those eyes. Pocket sand. Interesting, okay. Ooh, health potion right off the bat. I like that. I can get behind that. I haven't opened that one. I kind of expected him to be a little bit more mobile, being a rogue. How far does this lunge? Pretty far, okay. And I say that, but he does have a teleport. So... Sure. Might as well take a potion now. You do walk pretty slow when you block with the dagger. And I guess the dagger can only be in your offhand, from what it looks like. What? You're not gonna walk into obvious danger? Let me see those eyes. <laughs> Get blinded! Let's try our career ability. I wonder in order... Okay. I wonder if you need a dagger to use his career ability. His ultimate ability, I think is what they call it. Because he very clearly stabbed with the dagger. They did 300 damage too, that's... 
That's kind of disgusting. That's really good damage. Oh, I didn't look at any of the weapons back there. That one's better. Let's go ahead and swap it. One thing, looking back at the Maggie video, the mage video, one thing I really wish that they added is the tomes. I, I, I want them to, like, look different. So, like, the, all the fire tomes, except for, like, I think the color of the book itself. And I think it went from, like, a white to, like, a dull gray or a dull brown. But I wish they looked unique and different. Like, even this common sword versus the other sword, I am on fire. Where's the other sword so I can show? Yeah, these look different. Granted, it's a little subtle. Well, I wouldn't even say subtle. Like, the, um, the blade itself is different. I think they're... I think that one's curved a little bit. Yeah, it's kind of curved. It's got a curved blade, and it's got a different um, guard. Or this one has like a blue guard. Yeah, so even like a standard level one common item. Is this one level two? I think they're both level one. Yeah, they're both level one. They look very unique. Whereas the tomes, the the magic spell books, they didn't look unique. I, I kind of, I don't know. I'd like to see more variety there. But again, early access. So, you know, that probably will change. Pocket sand. Okay. Ow. Lunge. Okay, so it does stop on the first target you get to. Hmm. Woo! Having said that, that looks different. Like the pages, oh maybe it's just, yeah, the, maybe it's just the pages that look different. Cause like the back of that, oh now I can't really see the back. The back looks different than what I remember. Ow. Hmm. You can tack so fast when using uh, the dagger, which makes a lot of sense because it's a dagger. Um. Every tenth hit, gain a melee. Huh. Sure, yeah, I'll try it. Well, this is like a broken sword. Interesting. Whoa, hello. Excuse me, how far? Hmm, I wonder if my teleport can actually reach that far. It's on cooldown. All right, here we go. Let's see. Hmm, no, it's too far away. Well, that didn't work. Wait, did it work? Oh, I guess it did. All right. Let's go. Got some boots, magic attack. Well, don't use magic, but you know, what I might. Who knows? Uh, should we do a random tier two perk? Passively regenerates up to a max of 30% health or for a short period after dodging your next melee attack will daze. I think we're just going to roll the dice. <laughs> Deals 30% damage versus full... Yeah, that's not too bad. Name is a full health. Yeah. I may have to remember to lead with a power attack, if that's the case. Can't be missing loot. Ooh, look at that. What's that? It's a mace. Oh, actually, I'm going to grab the mace. Just because of the um, shrines that can give... That you can... Um, give items and they upgrade the rarity. Okay, so I may have been crazy then because these two books, now granted, tier one, fire book, tier two, uncommon, ice book. So they're going to look very different, but, and the text is different too. I just remember 
watching the Maggie video. Oh, and I had a purple, no, yeah, purple rarity uh, fire tome, and it didn't look that cool. It looked kind of basic, but I don't know. That's a very nitpicky thing to, to complain about. Um, yeah, I'll drop for it. Why not? Well, I'm not going to use it, but I'll drop. Okay. Common mace. Cool. Cool, cool. Yeah. One thing I am noticing, um, having played this it's my fourth run? Yeah, my fourth run. I'm not a fan, and this is going to be kind of a contradicting statement from my previous videos. I love the art style. I don't like the built-in film grain. Now, I know why they did the built-in film grain. Because it's very 80s style, and it makes it feel more like an 80s style cartoon. So, I... This is the only time that I would... I understand why they do it. I just really don't like film grain. Yeah. Oh, I missed. Oh, I do have to care for my stamina. Getting better all the time. Damn. Ah. <laughs> Wait, that backstab did a hundred damage. Why do we get three hundred that one time? Maybe it was a crit. That would make sense. I don't know if this can block arrows. Well, he missed, so... In your face. Huh. Ha ha. Wait, I don't think that actually did block the arrow. <laughs> I think the arrow hit me anyway. I know there's one more skeleton coming up, but... We'll give him a second to catch up. I think I might actually pick up that bow. So if I go one, two. Okay, cool. Um, uh, base damage. I'm gonna do the base damage. Every tenth hit, it's like, yeah. That doesn't seem too huge. So far, it's an interesting playstyle for the rogue. I don't know if it's my favorite, though. Now, I wonder if you can dual wield daggers. Let's do, let's do melee attack. Let's just kind of go all out aggressiveness. Uh, for a short period after dodging, your next melee I bleed. Um, the ambusher I don't think is super important with the rogue because he has quick attack speed. I'm gonna be using the dagger mostly, I think. Um, yeah, I think I'm just gonna go with swashbuckler. I, I have to remember to dodge though, which I'm not good at, but another pair of boots, huh? Dodge distance. One of these. Um, no. We're gonna stick with the boots we have right now. Getting a lot of heals. A lot of healing shrines. I am okay with that. Hmm. Where is the door? It's not there. It's not there. Is it over there? It is. Okay. That's part of the random generation weirdness that can happen. It's like, oh, I entered this door, but the exit's right there. Hello. Now that's what I call foreshadowing. Exactly. This guy gets it. He knows. Okay. Let's once and for all figure out if I can block arrows. 
Now, having said that, that big honker over there. Oh, he doesn't have a bow. Okay, cool. Excuse me? Okay. It... You can block... Oh, no, you can't block it. Okay. He was just a bad shot. Ooh. Alright, good to know. What's this? No. Hello, Mr. Skellybob. Dun, 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 I really like the attack speed of the dagger. The one thing I really don't like about it, whoops, is in order to use it, you have to um, block, which slows your movement, and I don't like that. Um, I want to try something real quick. So what happens if you just equip... Can you equip this in your... Can you equip the dagger in your main hand? Oh, no. Oh. Oh, no. Oops, I accidentally drank my health potion. Well. Wait, wait, there it is. Okay. Let's do this on the ground where I can actually see where I drop things. Oh, man. All right, let's see here. I have this sort of equipped right now, so let's go ahead and drop that. And... Oh, you can only equip it in the left hand. Yeah. I was going to say, if you could just left-click... If you could use the dagger without having to block, then I think it would be really good. But the dad's probably thought about that. Branching paths? Wait, let me go this way because it doesn't have one of those walls. This is an interesting layout. We haven't seen something like this yet. One thing I completely forgot to do. Oh, there's just loot here. Huh. One of those is just a random loot room. Magic defense, sure. Um, I didn't equip the artifact, so whatever the default artifact is, I think it's the one that, um, is the one I have. Whoops. Seven. So it looks like it's the same amount of damage. Okay. Yeah. Hey, yeah. All right. Check the loot first. Pocket sand. These enemies. Ow, I tried to dodge. That's fine. That's fine. We'll just do it this way. Nope. Go away, Archer. Oh, wait. I have ranged ability. Where'd you go? Okay. Poxan. Ow. That hurt a lot. How dare you, mushroom boy. Uh, book of fire. Hmm. I'm still on fire. Another book of fire. Um, resistance to ice damage and effects vulnerable to fire. Yeah, I don't think so. I think I run into fire way more than I do ice. 
At least at this level. Speaking of which, uh, let's see here. Stamina, melee, heal. Let's keep keep going melee. Deal damage to bleeding or dazed enemies. Yes, but I do need to remember to dodge to uh, proc the dazed, I think. Oh, oh. Don't forget that gold. I think this is the random loot, right? Yes, yeah, land random loot. Uh, sure. We'll do one more. Magic defense. Oh, it's a charm. Okay, sure. That was potion for a second. Alright, first... First boss area, I guess? Only fools trespass on my domain. And I do not grant intruders safe passage. You may take pride that you have come so far. Your incursion like... has come to an end. My minions will deal with you. My minions. Good luck, heroes. Right. I feel like I forget to use his abilities. Come on, beastie old chum. How about you just let me pass? Not feeling like Ah, gotcha. Not feeling like What the? Oh, Lord. I don't know how he missed, but I'm grateful. Die, mushroom. Ow. Not feeling much. Surprise. Not feeling much. Crit, 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 crit. Ooh, okay. Stabbed it, good damage. Oh, is it a guaranteed crit if I hit him in the back? It's really hard to tell. Oh, here we go. It looks like it is. Okay. Jesus. Wow. I did so bad. I didn't even get a rank. Tell you what, let's try that again. Uh, I do need to equip an artifact. Which one should I do? Let's go with health, cause looks like I kind of need it. Uh, I don't think I got any. Yeah, I didn't get any of that. Okay. Yeah, not worth. Okay, let's go again. Let's try our hands at Rico one more time. To me, a rogue is best in a team setting. Mainly because, like what I said earlier, they don't want to be a center of tension. They want to be sneak attacking, backstabbing, things like that. I think Rico is good. I just don't think he's good solo. I think he'd be much better in a team party setting. Because he'll be, he'll be able to do the backstabs much more efficiently. Um, he can create chaos with his pocket sand and whatnot so so even though so far he is my least favorite I think it's only because I've played him solo so far because like if I do pocket sand get a crit like yeah if, if you can take advantage of those crits then I think he's just going to be really strong. I think his damage will ramp really hard and really fast. Um, Did I open? I did open those. Okay, cool. Hopefully I'll be able to play, um, try co-op soon. I also don't even know if there's matchmaking in the co-op. I haven't looked yet. Let 
Now, I feel like Rico can also very easily use a bow. I mean, any class or any character can use any weapon, but certain ones are more adept. They benefit more from certain weapons. Ow. Like Victoria in the shield. You know, she gets... She's more proficient with the... Oh. She's more proficient with the shield, so she she's going to be able to use it more effectively. I think... Yep. That's where that's where you strive. Okay. I think a shortcut is our best bet. You want a combo your sword and your spear or in your dagger. Ooh, a spear would be a good weapon in this game. That'd be cool. I hope they add more I hope they add more everything. Weapons, characters, classes. I I don't want to assume they will, but I hope they do. Uh knowing that now, I'm taking more stamina. Windstruck, gain physical defense for a short period. I'm just not going to dodge anymore. We'll leave it up to the fates, I guess. Oh, okay. If I see a good bow, then I'll have to pick it up and use it. Yeah. Okay. That's where... Yep. I need to get in the hang of, of uh, chaining his dagger and his sword. I was gonna say, it doesn't feel good using just the dagger over and over again. It, But this feels... Yes, this is much better. This is very satisfying. Okay. We figured it out, guys. Boys and girls. Um, I hear something pitter-pattering around. What? What is this? Who are you? Show yourself. Sounds like a goblin. Yep, there you are. Ow. Anyone else feeling woozy? Ow, that hurt a lot. I do want to move that. I don't know what just hit me. Oh, it may just be Oh, I'm poisoned. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. Now, I wonder... I'm assuming I can use the thrust. Yeah, I can use the thrust, no matter what weapon I have equipped. Good to know. Sword in the stone? I was gonna make a joke that that's a shit sword in the stone, but it's actually better than my sword, so I can't say much. Uh, yeah, I think we're good to go. Ooh, it has bonus crits. Nice. Now, I assume... Yeah. The crit wasn't exclusive to um, Hawkins. Crit headshots with a bow. That's just how they work. Okay. I was trying to use my ultimate ability, but it's off cooldown. So. That would make sense. I'm also assuming that jumping in the water, jumping, jumping in the water, is instant death. I'm not going to try it. We're just going to assume for right now. How'd that first hit miss? Okay, now we'll be able to try it. Okay. I just hit him with my bow. <laughs> that animation's a little messed up. That's okay. Oh, perfect. Schmuck. Yeah, it's a whole new ball game. Now that I know you can chain his swings, I'm liking Rico 100% more now. I still think I stand by my statement that he will shine in co-op, but I think most of them will. Melee attack? Yeah, absolutely. Apps are positively lootly. Now that's what I call foreshadowing.
Your ranking is uh, slowly going up there, Rico. Which weapons? That's new. Please go away. In your face. Ooh. He is much harder to manage his stamina, though. Or maybe I'm just bad at managing the stamina, I should say. Oh, did I drop my bow? Oh. I did drop my bow. How did I drop my bow? I purposely bound my drop keys as far away as possible to not accidentally hit them. Oh, maybe the goblin took my bow? Because I think he did hit me. Maybe that's his old sh deal. Yeah, this is mechanic. Um, let's go with stamina max HP. I like that. Um, below half health. Okay. Yeah, these after dodge ones, I feel like are really wasted on me because I don't really dodge. Let's go with opportunist. We haven't tried that one yet. Looks good. Uh, ten thousand. I actually don't need that much more to to buy that, so, yeah, we're definitely gonna get out of these, uh, coffins. I just call them chests. Plus ominous. Ooh, new dagger. Okay. I like it. Hm. I like how Items can just be laying around too. That's kind of cool. Um, wind struck. That gives damage resistance. Bleeding and dazed. I don't bleed or dazed right now. Swords. So that's. I think it's only two swords and not daggers. That's what the wordage, the verbiage says. So I'm assuming that's what they mean. They have the passive heal though. I think we're gonna go with swords. Ward damage. Get out of here. I'm going to go ahead and shoot this so it doesn't blow up on me. I was stuttering there. Anyone else? It's surprise. Surprise, pocket sand. Anyone else feeling woozy? Never expect pocket sand. I don't know. Ow. Oh, I think she's being poisoned. Let's go ahead and heal that, because I have a feeling that poison damage is going to be quite a bit. For whatever reason, it seems like the game is skipping and stuttering more today than it did yesterday. I don't know why that is. I didn't change any of the settings, and I don't remember seeing their... I don't remember seeing an update for it. I don't know, maybe it's just me. And then I started again. If you guys see the stuttering in the recording, I apologize. I don't know what... what's going on.
Good lord. Oh, that was, yeah, that was just me being bad. <laughs> Ow! Meleeed with a bow. Get crit, son. Whoops. I really like the bow. It's just fun. Yeah. That dagger is not better than mine. Oh, Lordy, don't hit me. Thank you. A green dagger and that one actually gives bonus damage to things below a certain amount of health uh, to, um, below half health which will pair nicely with the perk we have the, the opportunist Unfortunately. I feel like if I get better with the timing of the parries or blocks, I don't want to call them block because, I mean, technically I am blocking, but it is different than the shield block. Wait, you blocked it? How'd you block my pocket sand? Okay. Yeah. That delay alone means that the game's... Something was going wrong with the game running smoothly, and I don't know why. I don't have a trinket or whatever, so I'll take it. Um, resist damage, ice effects. Yeah, that's the vulnerable to fire. I probably should not have taken that one, but... I'll be honest, I forgot I picked it up. Be real honest with you. Forgot all about it. It does seem like switching weapons on kill heal one. What is this one? Melee attack. Let's go with the heal one. I'm taking a lot of damage. Um. God, what was I saying? Good lord. Oh, it it seems like there's quite a bit of a delay with switching weapons in combat. Got you. Only fools trespass Got on my domain. Got and you. I do not grant intruders safe passage. You may take pride that you have come so far. Your incursion has come to an end. My minions will deal with you. My minions. Good luck, heroes. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hit the wrong button. Definitely hit the wrong button. No, oh, my stamina's low. Boxing. Okay, I... Where'd you go? There you are. Okay, listen. That poison. Damn you, poison. Can I hold an ability? Oh, nope, I cannot. Also... Just not noticing that I can level up. I don't know if I got that this fight or not. I don't know how much I'm paying attention. Pocket sand. Oh, 
not feeling my best. Okay. Not feeling my best. Ow. It seems like I'm not doing as much damage as I did before. Ow. Get out of here. Okay, he made me vulnerable. I thought he was going to poison me, but... Apparently that's not what that purple cloud does. Thought he hit me. Oh, is that all of you? That's all of you. All right. It's a bunch of white items, but um, I'm having such a problem with stamina. I think I'm gonna switch these. Plus, because I have the opportunist and the, yeah, the dagger that does more damage below half health. This one does more damage to full health, so they kind of balance each other out. Let's heal, because I need it desperately. Um, Pierce, when you dodge your uh, short period, your melee will do dazed or bounty hunter. I'm thinking bounty hunter. Enemies you kill have a 20% chance to drop two pieces of treasure. Yeah, let's go Bounty Hunter. I'm not using the bow enough to justify the, the bow perk. Although I probably should be using it more. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and, and proceed. I don't... <laughs> don't really like... We healed and that's all it healed us? Wow, you don't heal much from that. Oh, you know what? I think I remember... I think it said heal 50. Which I think we were on... 39, that makes sense, yeah. Okay, well, uh, it's 10,000, can't afford that. Um, I can't afford that. Oh, uh, we just... Do we save our gold? We can't really re-roll the table, and I can't afford that. I think even with maybe this extra gold here... We still won't be able to afford it. No, not at all. Okay. You know what? Let's go crazy. Let's go crazy. Shall we? We'll die trying at least. Alright. Excuse me, log. Oh, these guys are gonna be tougher too. I have bad feeling about this. Just lead it off with a. Well, now I know what happens if I fall off the map. Why do they have like fire shields around them? Oh, it's that thing. I've seen. I think it's like a witch or something. I've seen that before. Oh, she teleports. Okay. Yeah, I've seen her before in one of my other runs. But she didn't give them a fire, like, aura. I think she gave them a blue aura last time, so I'm guessing she's buffing them in some way. Okay. Why are you running? Come back here. Let's see if I can get her with the... Okay. With the pocket sand. Pocket sand. Okay. Pocket sand did not work. Ranked up to three? All right, well. I'm happy with that run. Alrighty, well, that was Rico. Interesting class. Um, They did a really good job... I feel like capturing the rogue class. Um, 
he's, in my opinion, the hardest to play. I think it's going to take more time to master the sword and dagger. Mastering the timing of blocking versus stabbing and counterattacking. And uh, it, he was fun, though. It, as soon as I learned that you could chain the sword slash and the dagger strikes, it changed the game. He felt so much more enjoyable once I learned that. Now, managing that and the stamina, I think, is going to be key. And the timing of the blocks, like I said. But I think he's got a lot of potential and, and really good. I think he also... I said previously that I think the rogue is going to be best in a team atmosphere. I'm not so sure now. Because he seems like he can stand by himself and also be really well in team play. So I think he did a really good job with him. But yeah, guys, that wraps it up for... This episode of Myth Force and Rico the Rogue. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next video and have a wonderful rest of your day.